right here at this Burlington Coat Factory on December 23rd. People, fearing the danger of what was going on inside, called the police for help and protection. What they got was an LAPD assault with a fully automatic weapon letting loose fire in a clothing store in holiday shopping season. An assault by the LAPD which left two people unnecessarily killed, including 14-year-old Valentina, who had come to America with her family and was full of hopes and dreams for the future. Hopes and dreams that were cut down by the reality of America. We have to confront some ugly truths. These police do not serve and protect the people. They serve and protect the system that rules over people. The revolutionary leader, Bob Avakian, has pointed out that all the reforms, all the struggles to abolish or defund the police, all the struggles to get different faces at top will lead to nothing but a cruel joke whose punchline is more blood and more tears. The only way this is going to end and truly be abolished is through a revolutionary struggle of millions rising up to overthrow and abolish the system that needs cowardly murdering pigs like the one who cut down Valentina. Bob Avakian has also pointed to how such a revolution is possible. Right now, because of the way this country is being torn apart and the way its democratic forms and norms will not hold it together. And as he has said in his new talk on Revcom.us, this will lead to something terrible or something truly emancipating if we go to work to build for this revolution. Bob Avakian has also pointed out that the kind of violence that we saw here is another example of the kind of thing that people need to learn to be organized, to stand together, to defend each other from. We are not calling for people to launch attacks against anybody, but the police have no right to carry out the terror and murder that they carry out, and the people have every right and responsibility to defend each other against such violence and other violence from official and unofficial sources. And doing so can contribute a great deal to making revolution. So we in the Revolution Club call on everybody to join this revolution and be part of filling this great need. And to the youth, especially those right now, too many of us whom are fighting and killing each other, start getting out of that and get into the revolution and fighting to defend each other from this kind of violence and terror. I'll end with this. Baba Vakin in this new talk something terrible or something truly emancipating says this there is no guarantee of achieving all this but there is real possibility and what we do what all those who want to see a world and a future worth living in where human beings everywhere can truly flourish in the fullness of their humanity what we all do can make a tremendous difference in what the outcome of all this will be there is the possibility, and there is the challenge. Dare to become part of the forces for this historic revolution. Dare to work resolutely to make this a reality. Dare to struggle. Dare to win.